Hello and welcome back to Somo Diecast. My name is Ron. Well, it's uh, time again for the Four Horsemen Challenge or Invitational for this time for the month of June. And the uh, casting they chose is a 2006 GTO. And this, uh, in Australia, these are were actually made by the Holden Company, which was licensed by Chevrolet. And it was called a Commodore. So the uh, objective of this build is to uh, enjoy the Australian influence. So let's go ahead and get this little guy blown apart and see what the pieces and parts are and we will get this build going. So everybody please stay tuned. All right, we got our little Australian Holden Commodore GTO, whatever you want to call it, all blown apart. Uh, hideous tempos, but I really hate those. Uh, two posts. Back when I kind of blew out, I'm not sure how I managed to do that, but uh, we can fix that. I already got the front one drilled and tapped. We'll work on that back one when once we get it stripped. Clear glass, a little scratched, we'll have to polish that up a little bit, and we'll take a little polish. This has uh, been played with quite a bit. Got a little wing for the back, that probably will find its way back onto this little car. And if you doubted this was a race car, put those doubts away, because other than the seat is on the, the wrong side, and the steering wheel. <laughs> Sorry guys. This is obviously an Australian vehicle. So it's set up for right hand drive and uh, we will keep it right hand drive since it is Australian influence. And our base, nicely detailed. So uh, we got a lot to play with on that. And we will be getting rid of these wheels and replacing with uh, something a little more race-oriented. I'm, uh, I'm picturing this as more of a rally car or uh, something along that line. Um, not exactly a stock car or a drag racer per se. I know some of these castings actually came with uh, wheelie bars on the back. This one did not. But uh, I'm thinking a nice little rally car is going to be something fun to build. So, All right, let's uh, go ahead and uh, we'll get that casting in the stripper. We'll get that windshield cleaned up as well as the rest of the plastic. And uh, we'll build, move this build along. So everybody, please stay tuned.
All right, before we get to the reveal, let's take just a moment and look back at where we started. This Hot Wheels 2006 GTO Australian Commodore from Holden. Let's uh, go ahead and get to the reveal and we will see how this car came out. Everybody, please stay tuned. Well, all right, we got our little uh, 2006 Holden GTO. It's actually a Holden Commodore. <coughs> Excuse me. And uh, I know they changed the theme from Australian and New Zealand influence to drag car. Well, I already had this started. And I already had a, the decals designed and printed, and uh, I my concept for this was uh, a rally car, and so I proceeded to go ahead and do that. This casting was not one with the wheelie bars in the back, <clears throat> although it looks like it probably could have been an alternative for that. But anyway. Tore it down, painted a beautiful shade of blue, detailed out the interior and the base, swapped on some wheels and chromed those out, made a set of uh, rally fog lights or rally lights for the front out of some dressmaker's pins, a little grinding work, and then of course, like I said, the custom decals printed those up with the mobile theme and the big Holden displayed proudly on the hood and on the back. And then uh, went ahead and detailed out the headlights, taillights, and a uh, little chrome trim around the windows and on the glass. And here it is. My 2006 Holden Commodore uh, rally car, or GTO if you will. Uh, I, uh, I really like this little car, and I, I uh, it's, but anyway, this is my build, and of course, this is for the Four Horsemen build for the month of June, and very happy to participate in that, and also very happy that they allow us to, or invite everybody to participate in that, in these builds. It's a great little exercise to take a common casting and turn it into something and uh, this one was uh, quite a lot of fun well if you uh, be sure you go out and check out all the other builds in it that are with the four horsemen and uh, I, I hope you like this video if you do please give me a thumbs up if you're not currently a subscriber I hope you will and be sure you share with your friends when you subscribe, be sure you ring the bell so you'll be notified of any future builds that I have coming along. And I will see you in the next.